Hello everyone and welcome to my playthrough of Factorio. Alright, last episode I was struggling to figure out what to do next. I've thought it over. And I think what I want to do is finally check out flamethrower turrets and build our wall up here. So, I remember looking for oil. Yeah, there's oil here. So we're going to have to take this oil all the way over here. So I'm going to need a lot of pipes. I don't have that many. So let's start by grabbing those. And then there were a bunch of other things that I either mentioned in the last episode or two, or I just thought of that I want to um, make sure we do. I don't know. I was not thinking while I was walking around. Pipes are back here. Um, that I want to do before we head up there. All right, so let's grab these. Ah, oh, my inventory is getting crazy again. I'm gonna have to deal with that before we go to. Um, let's make, uh, where are the pipes? Here they are. Oh, iron plates. Um, One of the things that I thought of was the combat shotgun. I remember making one, but I have no idea what happened to it. I'm going to look in my chest of junk and see if it's there, but I might have lost it that first time I died. I don't remember. Okay, fortunately those don't take very long to craft. Make a whole bunch of those. Oh, you're crafting more of those. Really? <sighs> okay. Uh, let's get rid of some of this coal. I am going to need a lot of coal for the tank. Because that thing churns through it. But let's get rid of most of it for now. Let's get rid of this stone. What else can I get rid of? Iron ore can go over here. Or actually, I can just put it in here. Or no, that, that smelts iron plates uh, here. Yeah. Uh, the wood can go in my junk chest. Iron sticks. Could we make more of these? And we've got two stacks. Um, actually... I'm, I might need some of these too, cause let me look at this again. Um, yeah, we have to run power all the way up here. Unless we use um, solar, if we did that, we would have to pump this stuff into tanks. Cause if we don't, then if it's nighttime, our Flamethrower turrets aren't going to do anything. Um, I think I'll just run power from over here. I think that would be easier. I don't know if 31 is enough to go that much of a distance. They do stretch pretty far, so I might be okay. But maybe I should make some more. Because, yeah, those take iron sticks uh, and steel. So let's grab some steel over here. don't know how many that will make 20 and I have 36 more of those of uh, the rods let's craft these until I need sticks yeah and then we'll stop okay that gives me 50 plus six uh, all right I'm gonna need pump jacks which are here. Uh, how many are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, those are different values. That's interesting. That one hardly has any in it, I guess. Okay. Well, anyway, one, two, three, four, five, six. So seven. I can make three. I need iron gear wheels. Uh, 
Uh, four. Oh, pipes. I was thinking it was iron gear wheels I needed more of. Um, okay. Let's run back down here again. I'm going to be doing lots of running around this episode. <laughs> I have a feeling. Uh, yeah, over here. Okay, and it was three, I'm crafting a fourth one, five, six, seven. There we go. All right, and then I said I wanted to try the combat shotgun. Oh, interestingly, that needs wood, I guess, for the handle. All right. Well, then let's go up here to my junk chest. Okay, combat shotgun. Oh yeah, and I can make these piercing shotgun shells. Those take steel in addition to more copper. Okay. I don't know if I'll actually use the combat shotgun while I'm in the tank, but I figured I'll make it anyway just so that I don't have a pistol, because at this point, I don't think a pistol is going to do much of anything to these biters. Uh, what did I say? Steel plates? Oh, and the shotgun shells, which are iron plates. All right. <laughs> Six. Well, that's not very many, is it? Need more copper. Wow, a stack only makes 19, huh? Oh, I guess it was iron too that I was short on. And now my inventory's full. There's 50. Okay, is that gonna give me 100 total? I think so. Which means I'll get 50 of these. Okay, let's, um, while those are crafting, those are going to take a while. While those are crafting, let's shove some more science down in here. We did get yellow science going, so that was exciting. Uh, blue... Okay, and I am still researching stuff, so that's good. Um, blue circuits, robot frames, low density structures. Let's get rid of the low density structures. And I don't know why I didn't think of it, but yeah, I had this chest here because I messed up the belts. And then I was like, that's a problem for future me. Well, this is future me. And I think what I can do is simply just drop them. What was it that needed these things? Was it the yellow science? Yeah, I'll just drop them here. Let's go get the rest. I'll pick this up. And no, it's going to take a couple of trips, but that's fine. Okay, one more maybe. Nope, two more. Yeah. 
And last one. Okay, let's make this a regular belt. Okay, now we have all these robot frames. Can I make my... Or actually, um, I was going to say logistic robots, but actually I wanted to look at... Was it these ones or these ones? Defender capsule. Distractor capsule. Um... What's the difference? Distractor, intermediate type of combat robot stays on the deployed position to shoot and distract enemies. Okay, so it's like a turret, but it's a robot. All right, and then this one, most basic type of combat robot follows and helps the player for a short time period. Oh, and then these, which I did not research yet, the most advanced type of combat robot follows and helps the player for a limited time period. Yeah, it seems like these ones might be really good, but I don't have them yet. These ones, I don't know. They didn't seem so good, but maybe if I had a bunch more, they would be helpful. Um, in any case, do they take the robot frames? No, those actually take the defender capsules. Huh. Well, anyway, they don't take the robot frames, so... I'm not going to worry about it. What is this? Discharge defense remote. Is that for like blowing up TNT from far away or something? Seems kind of cool. Uh, anyway, all right. So then, yeah, can I make some of these? I guess I don't have many red circuits on me, huh? I have one. Oh, look at this. I, I lost quite a few robots, too. Well, that's a bummer. Five, six, seven, eight. Let's make those. And then how many robot frames do I have now? Where'd they go? 16. So I can make six. And I'll need 10, which means I need 20 red circuits. Oh. Well, it didn't even make them all. Okay. All right, what I meant to say was it couldn't make them all without making red circuits. So let me just, actually here, we'll grab half a stack. Also, I wanted to change this so it doesn't fill up every time. I don't, cause I never, I don't think I need to grab more than a few stacks of those out of there at a time. So no sense in refilling that all the whole chest the whole time or all the time. Uh, okay. Shotgun shells finished. I can only make 12 because I need copper. Um, but what did I grab the red circuits for? Was it the bots? These? Yeah. And it was because I had 16 robot frames. Yes. So let's make 16 of those. Uh, and then let's go grab more copper. Uh, can I get rid of these green circuits anywhere? Can we drop them down here? Yep, that works. Blue circuits. Can I drop those in here? Yep. Red circuits. I hope none of the other stuff I was thinking about crafting needs any of this, because then I'll have to come back and get it back again. Uh, let's just drop them up here on the belt. There's not that many of them.
It's going to take me all episode just to get ready before we can even go. Sheesh. Had so much stuff I wanted to do. All right, did I make the combat shotgun? Let's put that here. Cannot shoot firearm magazine. Oh, well, yeah, I know that. Okay, there we go. And where were my shells at? Copper plates. This chest, if I recall, was almost empty. Oh, we're doing okay. 38. I think that was going to use up all 100. Um, shotgun shells, regular shotgun shells. Okay, and then the other thing I wanted to check out was what I totally forgot about with the tank is it can shoot these, these cannon shells. And I didn't have explosives at the time, but I do now. Um, so, and then there were also explosive cannon shells. Which I think are just like a stronger version. Projectile range 30, piercing power 300. Oh, so these pierce more, so they probably are better against armored units. And these are better against... I guess enemies that don't like, don't have explosion resistance. Um, so maybe these are good for biters and these are good for spawners, I suppose. I don't really know. Uh, okay, so steel plates, plastic, and explosives. Steel plates, we'll grab more up here. Uh, explosives, did I make those over here or over on the left side? I don't remember. Was it down this direction, maybe? I know I made cliff explosives too. Hmm. Where in the world did I make those? Plastic we got right here. Don't know how much I need, but we'll just take all that. Um, where was it? here? No, or, oh, was it up here? Uh, oh yeah, cliff explosives are here. Explosives, yes, are right here. I was looking right at them and I didn't even register that's what they were. Okay, so yeah, they are up there. Okay. Uh, well, without trying to distract myself too much. I know it's walking back and forth, but my mind is working in a linear fashion at the moment. So I'm going to just come over here and grab these right now before I forget. And I did not put these in a chest. I guess we could do that. Oh, I thought the power would reach. I guess not. All right, and then we'll limit this to like that many. And then I'll just grab a bunch off the belt here. Don't want to grab the sulfur though. Okay. Like it's over a hundred. Okay, yeah, so that'll give me a hundred of these. Um, there's a hundred. Okay. My shotgun shells are still going. I'll 
drop the rest of these off in there. And then what else did I write down? Uh, we need to grab the flamethrower turrets. Those I was putting in a chest down here. Uh oh, what's this? Coal pickup. Yeah, these attacks down here are going to start ramping up soon. Were they here? Yeah, looks like it. How many do we have? A lot. Too many, in fact. Let's limit that. Yeah, I don't know if I'm ever going to even use this many. <laughs> Why didn't I limit that chest? Yikes. Probably because I didn't think it was going to make that many. Okay. Uh, I don't even know if we'll need a hundred. I guess we do if we want to put it... If we want no gaps in this wall, we might. But I don't know if this oil can even fill up that many. I guess we'll find out. Okay, so I've got pump jacks. I've got the power poles. I've got little power poles. I have pipes. I don't... That's probably enough pipes. And then, yeah, these undergrounds... And we got the flamethrowers. Oh, these can take different types of oil, I just noticed. Is one better than another for fuel? Oh, look at that. It has like a, a range. That's cool. Yeah, what does this say? Oh, you can't click on it. Fires a stream of burning liquid at enemies. It doesn't say anything about the different types of oil that it takes. Huh. Okay. I don't know if it matters. Hopefully it can just take the regular oil and it won't be a waste. I'm wondering if I processed it, if it would be better. Like it would, I don't know, use less or something, but maybe not. Uh, okay. So we have everything we need for the wall. Oh, well, except for walls themselves. I don't think I have that many. Do I? Do I have any? I have 80. Yeah, I definitely need more than that. So let's go grab a bunch of walls. Which are up here. Right over here. Maybe that many? Depends on how thick I want to make the wall. If this is going to be more of a permanent wall, I wonder if I should do like three thick or maybe even four. I don't know. I guess we'll just go up there and see how much we've got. Um, okay. What else? Oh, I wrote down portable lasers. But I don't think I researched that yet, did I? Oh, I did. Personal laser defense. That takes blue circuits, low density structures, and laser turrets. Um... And it goes in my armor. I don't think my armor, the kind I have right now, is conducive to that, though. So I think we'll hold off on that. Um, I did not make all of those shotgun shells. What in the world? I thought it was two to one. Didn't I make a hundred of these? I thought I did. Oh well, I guess not. Okay, so let's go up here. Let's get rid of any more junk that we can. I know I've got wood that can go. Uh, oh, I should make more of these repair packs too. I ran through those like crazy last time. Uh, let's put these stone furnaces in there and the electric furnaces. I want to use those, but I crafted them on accident. Uh, my pistols, do I have any more? Yeah, I have two there. Now I've got three. 
Solar panels. I haven't been using these. So let's store those in there as well. Um, oh, I do have 12 more. I was just blind. There we go. Okay. And my shells are crafting. I have lots of ammo. Uh, should I take... Oh, I had four flamethrower turrets. Should I take regular gun turrets too? If these things have a minimum range... Well, I guess that just means I need to put them away from the wall. So like, if, let's pretend this is the wall. I guess they'd need to go like here. And so, yeah, maybe I'll be okay without having regular turrets. I hope, I really hope that's the case. Okay, stone bricks, we can get rid of those again. Can I just put them in here? Oh, well, I can drop them on the belt. There we go. Okay. The plastic. Let's put that back. Uh, it was down here. Oh, except I removed that chest, didn't I? Is this an in chest? Oh, well. Okay, that's not gonna work. I guess I'll put the chest back. Okay. And then ammo. I think that'll be enough. I think we're ready to go. Let's go grab us some more coal. I thought I had a chest of coal somewhere. Where would I have put that? I don't know. We'll just grab it off the belt here. How many are we going to need? Like four stacks? Yeah, I think that'll be enough. Uh, and then also, while I was thinking of it... I wonder if it would be, no, probably not. I was going to say, I wonder if I should craft a second tank, but it seems like if I ever do um, get in a bad spot and I lose the tank, I just die immediately anyway. <laughs> I was wondering if maybe I could get in the, get in a second tank and potentially survive, but I don't think that's going to happen actually. So never mind. Uh, and then also I wanted to check these out. Cluster grenades. I think it said these do a secondary explosion. So that can be fun. That requires explosives. And of course I put those away. So let's go grab some of those and just make a few of them and try them out. Those were up here. Okay. Steel plates. I was not paying attention to what else I needed. I have steel plates coming here, but they're pretty slim pickings. Probably have to look into that soon. My whole iron and copper situation just doesn't, still doesn't seem good. I don't really know what I'm doing wrong with it other than maybe just getting the ratios wrong or maybe just not building enough. I don't know. All right, that'll give me 10 of those. I guess that's fine. And then let's go ahead and grab some more grenades too while we're here. Sure. Okay. Now, do these need anything except the oil? Do they need power? I hope not. Do they? It just says fuel. So I don't think so. 
Those look pretty cool. Wow. Okay. I think we're finally ready to go. So let's hop in the train. Hopefully it won't take off before we get there. Yeah, that one front car seems to take forever to unload now. All right, let's go to pickup. Oh, I didn't hop in, really? There. Okay, and then let's organize this a little bit. Oh, I can't put my cluster grenades on there yet. Oh shoot, I forgot to make more of these repair packs. What do those take again? Green circuits. And I had those and I put them away. <laughs> of course. I know I'm going to need those. So we got to go back. Sorry guys. I'm definitely going to need those though. Well, I keep saying that like I need to do combat up here. I don't really need to do any combat up here because I already took everything out. I was thinking of combat down here where there's tons of combat that's going to be happening, but we're not quite ready for that. Well, I mean, we are now since I've been doing all this stuff, but anyway. All right. So green circuits are right here. How many can I make? A hundred. Let's grab another half of a stack. Make 50 more. Yeah, 150. That should be good, hopefully. Okay, then let's hop back in here. We'll go back to pick up again. My power armor is researching. That's exciting. That one said, yeah, armor with a huge equipment grid and inventory size bonus. I like the sound of both of those things. Very exciting things are coming now that we have the yellow science going. Okay. Oh, actually, I need to go over here and bring the oil over first. Okay. Uh, whoops, don't get in the train. Don't want that. All right, let's take the car to start with. I hope I brought enough coal for this fuel. Okay, we're gonna go up to the oil. Oh, shoot. I need to run power this whole way. Okay. Let's start that right here. I think I can do it while I'm driving. That's not dangerous at all. <laughs> Don't text and drive, but you can build and drive. No problem. Um, okay, do I want to go... Yeah, we basically want to go... It's not quite a 45 degree angle. But close. I wonder if I should... I wonder if I should have brought cliff explosives with me too. I might be regretting that. Alright, how far can you reach? There. Okay, and then we'll click and drag. I guess I'm not going to fuss about this placement too much. We'll just kind of wing it here. Uh, I guess let's go this way. I can not hit these cliffs. Um, I'm just going to get out of the car because... 
a bit tricky driving through all these trees. Another coal patch. And we'll have power by it whenever we decide we want to expand out here. That's cool. Okay, maybe we'll go here. And then we will grab our pump jacks. Yep, we'll point them to the left. And then we'll get our power poles. We need two to power those, unfortunately. Can we do all of these three? Uh, nope, won't reach. So we gotta do, I guess, one for this one. Oh, well, the, it won't connect anyway. Okay, that gets all of those. Then that one, and then that one. That should be all of them. Okay, and then we'll grab our pipes, and we'll come... Down this way. Um, this will go, or no, not here. Here. You can come straight up. Um, this one's not in a great position. I guess I'll go that way with that one. Then over here, you can go there. You can go there. And this guy has to come all the way up here. There we go. Okay. Now this is uh, a pain because we have to go diagonally. Um, are these going to be a problem? Yeah, probably so. I'm guessing these put off pollution. Let's go try out our combat shotgun. Are these just... Uh, worms or what? Oh, it's a giant one. Whoa, okay, that's way better. <laughs> wow. It fires fast. It churns through the ammo, though. Wow, okay. Well, yeah, that seems like it could be good for taking out large groups of biters. Cool, okay. Well, they wouldn't have been a problem, but I guess now they definitely won't be. All right. So yeah, this is gonna be tricky. Um, let's actually go from here, because I think this was the, the one that didn't have much left in it, so we'll get these all going this way. I don't know if it matters, but we'll do it that way, okay. So yeah, I guess we're gonna have to go Excuse me. Um, kind of zigzag a bit. Whoops. Um, let's avoid the coal. Not that it matters probably that much, but. Okay. 
Man, I wish it would let you see through the trees when you're like hovering your mouse over them. Oh, this is getting nasty. Now I see what you guys mean. I probably should have just gone around, huh? Um, yeah, let's just do that. Can I even pick these up? Hopefully I got, I don't think I got the other one, but I can't really get it. Can't really get this one either without chopping the tree down. All right, let's just go this way then. Oops. Ah. Okay, is this enough room? Yeah. Okay, so let's start going this way now. Definitely should have brought cliff explosives. Yep, that's going to be a problem. Let's go up. Seeing that flashing yellow. Okay, what now? Um, guess I should have gone down again. I don't want to go through all that. This is a long pipeway. Or pipeline, I should say. Uh, where are we at? Where do I want to put this wall even? I kind of want to get this copper behind the wall. Do I have any other, I mean, I guess I have a couple small ones. That one's a good size one. So is that, uh, any other ones? No, I don't see any, just this one, this one, and these two. Yeah, I really think I should, in which case, I should probably bring it like up through here. And then, yeah, these cliffs are kind of a problem. I might want to go back 
and grab some cliff explosives actually to deal with that. This episode's already getting close to being done and we haven't even gotten to the action yet. Man, oh man. Lots to do. All right. Um, I'm gonna... I thought about using my locomotive, but I think that's a bad idea. Let's just call the train. Because, yeah, if I want to make the wall here, like I got cliff here, cliff here, cliff here, cliff here, 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 all this cliff. That's, and then, yeah, we have it over here. I mean, I guess I could square it off. Like, maybe I could square it off here. Oh, there's another ore, copper ore there, too. But I think it would be easier to just get the cliff explosives. All right, let's go back to drop off again. If I have this combat shotgun, I don't even think I need to carry a regular shotgun anymore. Seems kind of useless in comparison. Alright, so cliff explosives. Hopefully I've got a bunch. I probably do. I guess there's only one assembler, but how's it been doing? Oh. No, I don't have that many, actually. How come? What are you waiting on? Empty barrels? What? Why? You're not unloading into there. Why is that? Oh, is this because... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. I had this thing with empty barrels in it. Okay. Well, I don't think I want to make that many. Maybe... Uh, maybe... That many. Yeah. I don't want to get into the same situation as with the... Uh, what was the other thing I looked at recently? Red circuits? And I was like, I'm never going to need... Or no, it was the turrets. The flamethrower turrets. Yeah, so let's limit those. All right, I should have put the train in manual mode. Did not think about it, although it's filling up pretty fast. I don't want to wait, though. You come back. It would be kind of cool to uh, make your own personal rail system that's separate. Is that silly? I think it might be kind of cool. You make your own personal rail lines that go everywhere you you frequently want to go to and it doesn't interfere with your cargo trains. That might be kind of a cool idea to explore at some point. And then you could have it be like super fast since this one is a lot slower because it has the wagons on it. That might be kind of cool. All right, so we got our cliff explosives now and we got to go back up here to do the oil. Uh, let's grab the car. Head back up. Here we are. Okay. So we need to start going up. Oh, 
Oh no, did I seriously run out? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. I thought I had enough of those. Man, I'm sorry guys. I gotta go all the way back again. How frustrating. Uh, I can't craft any, right? Because they take like a bajillion pipes. Yeah, oh, and iron plates. Aye, aye, aye. Okay. I really thought I would have had enough of those, but it is a long distance, so... I guess I shouldn't be too surprised, even though I am. Hit an invisible cliff. Pipes were down here. Let's just craft a ton more of these. Oh, iron plates, right. Uh, I have like multiple chests of these way back here. This area looks funny at nighttime with the night vision goggles because there's no lamps. It looks odd. All right, uh, where are they? I had, oh, here they are. Yeah, tons of iron plates in here. All right, that can do 40. Sixty. A hundred, I believe. And that's all the pipes I had. Hopefully a hundred more is enough. I don't know if it will be. And we gotta go grab more pipes because I just used almost all of them. Hopefully no more interruptions. Wow, we're at almost an hour on this video already. Yikes. Okay, let's just take the car instead of the train. Train is behind me, so hopefully there's no issues with running into it. robots. Oops. Can I not fit through that gate? What's the deal? There we go. Alright. And where did I get to on these things? Right here. Alright. And we need to go like here-ish. Uh, let's go up again. Huh. Look at that. Item on ground. Why is that there? That was weird. Just random stones lying around. I guess the biters attacked them or something? Or, oh, I guess I did combat up here, maybe... I think I did mention that actually in one of my videos where I saw the biters attacking 
stone, and I was like, what in the world is up with that? It was really weird. Alright, maybe come... Here would probably be good, actually. Then we'll go back over this way. Whoops. Then maybe we'll go up here. Okay, how close are we getting to the biters? Kind of close, but not in danger yet. But I do need to be cognizant of where they are. Uh, oh shoot, they're actually attacking right below where I am. Hello, there you are. Yeah, that was pretty good, that combat shotgun. Not bad at all. But I don't want to risk it on foot. I definitely want to be in my tank. Um, however, I do have those other grenades. Where did they go? Here. Put those on my hot bar. And... Yeah, let's just... Uh, Go take these out because, yeah, this nest is huge. Um, yeah, very scary. Well, let's, let's actually just keep going a little bit further. So you're actually going to come this way. Maybe we can go, well, let's get rid of these cliffs, actually. Man, that is satisfying. Cool. Let's do these two just because these could attack, or I mean, attack. These could uh, hinder my. Hinder my attack is what I think I was trying to say in my brain. Yeah, this is great. Um, I want to save some for down here, though. Although I do want these gone. Actually, I want these gone, too. I just want them all gone. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this, this one up here looks really scary, actually. I really hope I don't die here. Okay, so I have these cannon shells now. Oh, and I never went and grabbed more flamethrower ammo. Man, hopefully that's enough. And then we got regular ammo and we got our, I'm just gonna put that much in. Well, actually, I'll just leave one stack. <sighs> okay, so let's try the the shells. I don't know how far away these things attack either. Or like shoot. Oh, and I have the grenades too. Okay. Um, let's just fire one and see what happens. Oh, does it go where your cursor is? Oh, they go about that far. Okay.
Uh, pretty slow. They do some good damage, though. But yeah, pretty slow. Maybe they'd be good for the... Uh-oh. Stuck on a rock. No, 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 no. Really? <sighs> of course I got stuck on a rock. That was awful. Just awful. Ah, oh, man. And it's right by the nest, too, so it's not like I can run in there real quick and and get my body either. Ah, oh, jeez. Terrible. This episode has not been going well for me. Man. All right, tank needs steel plates, iron gear wheels, green, or jeez, red, and engines. Ay ay ay. Iron gear wheels. How many was it? Fifteen. All right, let's put these back. I'll probably need them for other stuff, though. Red circuits, and what was the other thing? Engines. Ah, oh, that makes me mad. You prepare and you prepare, and you still fail, like, Almost immediately, like I'd barely even got to do anything and I failed. Jeez. Awful. <sighs> okay. I can make a tank now. Oh, engines, right. Okay. Got my tank. Um, ammo, flamethrower ammo, coal. I think that'll be enough. Oh, should I make another armor? Nah, we'll just live dangerously. Yeah, that armor, like I was saying, it barely helps at all. Once you're out of the tank, you're like, you're in trouble. <sighs> okay, flamethrower ammo is down here somewhere. Uh, did I go too far? I think I did. Yeah, it's up here. Not much of that. Man. I said last episode, I think... Oh, I should have brought more steel down there. And now I'm saying it again. Let's just grab a bunch. Let's grab that many. Because we seem to churn through that ammo pretty quick. And then you will get 10 stacks, and you will get the other 10. Plus a little extra, apparently. Alright, so tank, ammo, flamethrower ammo, let's get coal. Should be enough. All right. Hopefully that's enough. This thing churns through a lot of coal. Uh, let's also load it. 
There we go. Get my flamethrower at the ready. gonna be a quiet tank ride I'm just sitting here mulling over how annoyed I am <laughs> dying up there Ugh. I hope it gets to a point where combat is like no longer a big deal I'm guessing like that giant spider Tron is probably uh, pretty good at combat, I would, I would guess. At least I would hope. Anyway, of course, now it's nighttime, so we can't see anything, so that'll make it extra fun here. Looks like... Oh, no, that's just a biter. I thought that was my body. Oh, my body's probably right there. In that mess. Here they come. Oh, and I have no... Oh, I have no repair packs. Oh, this is going to be terrible. This is going to be impossible. There's no way. I can't do this without repair packs. Uh, I do this all the time. I like I try to think of everything I need and it just never works. <sighs> Idiot place Factorio, I tell you. I gotta go back and get repair packs. I can't do it without them. There's just no way. That nest is way too huge. This is gonna be a super long episode. Um, wait. Train, wait, stop. Come back. Okay. <sighs> yeah, repair packs. Anything else? I mean, some robots would be nice to help me repair, but I can't do that without my armor and more robots and everything. I should probably make some kind of um, death chest that where if I die I can just go there and grab everything I need to go get my body back. Because also I have to worry about the fact that my body is going to despawn pretty quick here too. Which is pretty concerning. Um, what was it? Circuits and iron or something? Circuits and wheels. Okay. I'm just gonna grab more coal, cause who knows. Perfect timing to get back in the train. Maybe this artillery will be what I need. I don't know. Oh, you know what else I just thought of that I could try, actually? Um, I could try to hook up the, the turrets the flame turrets before I get up there and then like bait them back to the turrets where they are. That might be a good idea. Where's my pipeline? It's over here. Yeah, maybe we should try that. It goes over here. Right over to here. 
Yeah, let's try it. Oh, except I don't have them. <laughs> of course I don't have them. That nah, can't do that. Uh, all right, well, I have the flamethrower ammo. I have my repair kits. I'm just going to have to, like, do this a little bit at a time. I think. Jeez, there's so many, though. It's like I can't even get in there to take out the spawners because there's so many biters. Yeah, as soon as I attacked the spawners, they all came to attack. Tank is half health. And of course I had that fish on me. And I didn't think to use that either. Okay, can you like go away acid, please? Any day now. Thank you. Alright. So, yeah, they see they've all respawned already. Let's take out some more spawners if I can. Wow. Tank is getting low on health again. All right, we made it barely, but still one left. And I'm driving through acid. Okay, barely made it. We're getting there very slowly, but I'm also running out of flamethrower ammo. Yeah, I got 51 now. This is looking bad. This is looking real bad. I might be able to survive. It's going to be close. Oh, come on. Did I get him? I think I got him. Wow, I did survive. That was very, very close. Okay, down to 37 armor uh, ammo now. Let's try to take out some more spawners first if we can. I can't reach. Fuel. I 
have more fuel, right? I hope. Yeah, I do. Okay. Uh, let's also fill the ammo. All right. Will I be able to finish it off this time? I hope. I don't know. There's still a lot there. Okay, well that went better. Repair. We're getting there slowly. Uh, I really hope my body hasn't despawned too. Okay, I think I got everything. Finally. Whew. Okay, please, please, please tell me my body is still here. Oh boy, okay. No, it's gone, guys. Oh, that's horrible. Oh, that really bums me out, man. Okay. Well, I'm going to call it there. <laughs> I'm not a happy camper at the moment. We're going to have to go back to the base and redo everything we did this episode all over again. I have to get all new supplies, more flamethrower turrets, more walls, everything. Oh, so sad. <laughs> anyway, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'll catch you in the next episode. Take care, everybody.